Remember the assassination of a Hamas operative allegedly perpetrated by Israeli agents in Dubai two years ago? Well, here comes the film. It's called Kidon and is loosely based on what the director calls a fascinating real-life event. Seeing some spies caught on video cameras, seeing someone who's going to be killed in a few hours, seeing him followed by people. For everybody, anyone who loves stories, who loves uh, spy movies, who loves um, cinema, it's, it's very appealing. It's a Franco-Israeli production with some big names on board, such as local supermodel Bar Raffaeli. In this scene, she plays a temptress, luring her male victim into her net. She says she has always dreamed of working for Mossad, the Israeli Secret Service suspected of having carried out the killing in Dubai. I mean, who wouldn't want to do something that is interesting, secretive? Um, it's, I mean, it's the Mossad. <laughs> Don't let appearances fool you. Most of the cast are Israeli and so is the location. A fancy hotel by the Red Sea comparable to the one in Dubai where the killers were supposedly caught on camera before and after doing the deed in the victim's room. As shooting gets underway, the set looks somewhat chaotic, but that doesn't seem to bother the French-Israeli comedian Sicily. So, Tomer, you know, this is kind of part of working here, you know, with Israelis. Did you shoot that? Yes, I did. <laughs> Keep it. Show it. You have to show it. This is the Israeli way. But it all finishes. It all ends up fine. You just have to, you know, argue a little bit. Tomer says that the light mood on set is not an indication that the film will be a comedy but a way to deal with the pressure that comes with having to perform. No one here is willing to say much more about the special twist that this cast has promised to bring to an otherwise very serious story. The film is expected to come out next year.